My son, when he decided to start Purple Hearts and Heroes, I was behind him 100%. I've tried to support him in everything that he did, and I think a lot of our family are very, a lot of kids, we're caregivers, I think. We want to do for other people. We want to make other people happy. And he decided that he wanted to give back. He wanted to give back by the way of um, wounded veterans, deserving veterans, handicapped children, and children of the fall. So he decided to, to start the organization, and I did whatever I could do to help him. This foundation I found a couple years ago, I retired from the Marine Corps due to injuries from combat. And that was my love. I mean, I, I had the greatest job in the world. I didn't have the greatest job in the Marine Corps. I had the greatest job in the world. And that was taken away from me. I would so much rather see that kid or that veteran come out here who needs a break from life, have a great time, and that's mainly what it's about. So I always say the hunt's not always about the kill, it's about the friendships, the bonds, the fellowship. That harvest, when you harvest that animal, that's just icing on a cake. It's thick icing, and it's sweet icing, and it makes the whole package complete. It's changed my life forever. And I'm sure that if anybody would be getting into Purple Hearts and Heroes for the first time or any organization, you know, especially Purple Hearts and Heroes, it'll change your life forever. As a parent, I could never, ever repay anybody that's had a part or had a hand at this organization or this family or this film crew or the guides. And you. They'll never know. They'll never know. One day they'll know, one day. But on this earth, there's no way I could ever express how I feel with my gratitude.